what most people's attics look like um, before they're properly insulated, where you have about three or four inches of insulation. You can see it's all discolored because air has been passing through it, which de degrades the R value of that insulation. And then you can move over here. This is kind of like what a retrofit after it's done, you pull that insulation out and then you have proper venting. You blow in, this is an example of six or seven inches, but usually it's about 14 or 15 inches. And that's really the main problem in most people's homes is, is inadequate insulation. How often should you change out your insulation? Uh, if it's done right, you should never have to. Okay, um, good to know. Especially with the insulation like this, it's just it's very green recycled newspaper. Um, it's called cellulose. It's actually kind of funny. You find it in your, if you, if you uh, have Parmesan cheese at home and you look at the back, the last ingredient is cellulose. So yeah, that's how safe it is. It's very, very green, very green material. Thank you.